Hey guys, back again. It's been about 45 to 50 minutes since I last talked to you in the first video. Now, since I'm almost an hour in, what I'm gonna do now is take some canola oil. You can either take some canola oil or you can even mix like red wine and vinegar or something, something just to keep it moist. Or you can even use, you know, spray butter if you want to. But I'm gonna go ahead and use the canola oil. I did, I did hit it with some spray butter a little earlier. But this time I'm gonna go ahead and just hit it with some canola oil just to keep it from um, drying out. Just a little bit, kind of hit it. Now it's all moist. And basically, and I'll just close the grill. I don't want the temperature to see me having a lid open for a while showing you just dropping down to almost 200 degrees. I want to get it back close to three and just let it kind of cruise control on through. So the next video I'm going to do is probably towards the end, show, show you the finished product. And, uh, and we, yeah, yeah, we'll just go from there, guys. Um, yeah, it's kind of climbing fast. It's 250 degrees. Just note I have the second burner off right now. I only got the the ones on the side on load. That's keeping the temperature um, at the 275 to 300 degree mark. So yeah, um, and what I'm supposed to be doing, I should be rotating the um, butt two on here. I'll probably do that after in a little bit when I get off of here. Um, and just rotate it then about by every hour kind of rotate the butt around just to kind of give it an even smoke so just take care guys i'll see you in the next video be safe it's a warm saturday out there